and end it. Are you sure Karen never checked in at all, There's Kevin? no one even close to her description at that rehab center. And my friend checked everyone by sight, just in case she used a different name. But she said she was leaving town to check into that clinic. She even took a leave of absence from work. Well, have you asked Eve? Yeah, she hasn't heard from her. She just disappeared. Look, let me check around, okay? There's got to be an explanation. I bet there's an explanation, and we both know what it is. Frank, don't jump to conclusions. It's the worst explanation of all. Karen ha has lost it. She's gone off the deep end, and she's off doing what addicts do. Getting high. Oh, my God. Chris. Karen, hey. How was the shower? Wet, but it didn't help. I'm still sleepy and achy. My shoulder, and then the snee. How's your appetite? <sighs> Better. In fact, I ordered myself a pizza. It should yeah. be here any minute. Anything new from the lab? I know you said you were expecting my latest blood work. Is that them? What do they say? It's nothing conclusive. Uh, let me see. You know what we need to do is run another panel. I said, let me see, doctor. Now. Thank you. Myoglobin is elevated. Enzymes. Creatinine levels are off the scale. I'm sure it's, it's a mistake. It's got to be. <laughs> This can't be mine, Chris. This, this isn't me. This belongs to someone who's old, ancient. Someone whose major organs are, are failing. No. Where were we? Come here. I miss this. What, dancing? We, we never really danced no, that much. No, no, no. Holding you like this. It's the truest thing I know. The truth, Ian. It's important. My wife. <laughs> I wish you hadn't done that. Nice tone, Slayer. Glad you got that all out. Time to die now. Maybe, but maybe not. Maybe it's your time to die, huh? You know, you have awfully pretty little fangs there, vampire. But you know us Slayers, we have defenses of our own. And you know, the closer that I get to you, the stronger my powers become. Ah, uh, but you forget. You don't know how to use them yet. Ah, but I do. I've been practicing. Besides, I feel it in my bones. For generations, my family is dead. I killed them all. And I'll kill you, too. You may try, but it's not gonna work this time. This time, this layer gets to destroy you. Maybe. Good. Give me the crossbow. Hand it over. Throw it to me and then run. I want you to toss it to me and run. Get out of here now. <laughs> run from the one I love? I, I don't understand, Lizzie. Why would I want to do that? Thanks, thanks, Rhonda. If, if you hear from Karen, anything at all, just, Frank. just let, let me know, okay? Right, bye. Anything? Not a word, you? Well, I'm not sure, but check this out. Now, it might just be a coincidence. Or maybe not. Yeah. Come on. Where are we going? What do you think? Let's go. Okay. Come on, hurry. All right, all right, all right. I don't understand the report, if it's right. I had him run it twice. But how could my internal organs be, be aging this quickly? That's impossible. 
Uh, tell me I'm reading this wrong. I wish I could. I've been over and over the results, Karen. There's no reason at all why your body should be aging this fast. I just don't know. Then what do you know, huh? I know that if we don't stop the aging process... I'll be dead. At this rate, I'll, I'll be dead by next week. <laughs> Wild wife of mine, say something. How did you know? How did I know? Is that what you care about? And how I knew that you were going to pump me full of tooth, sir? No, that's not all I care about. But I'm surprised. Surprised? Maybe not as surprised as I was. When security called me from the hospital and said that my wife had taken an unauthorized bottle of sodium pentothal. Huh? What were you thinking? What was your plan? I had to. I had to be sure for my sake and the baby's. What? Sure about me? I had to know the truth once and for all about Anne Marie, about the kidnapping. I told you I'm the trying truth. to take Danny. I was honest with you. Really? About what? About every single particular aspect of my life from the very beginning. I told you everything. I told you everything, but you wouldn't believe me. How could I be that way? Right when you're such an open book. No secrets, no lies. You tell me everything, right? Everything, that's right. Really? Because I don't seem to recall you telling me that you slept with Lucy. What makes this silly woman think that you'd give her back her nasty little slayer thing? Because the silly woman doesn't think. Livy, you can't, you can't be. You're not with him, are you? See, she tries, but... Silly. Silly. Why? Why would you do that? Because I love him. What? How can you love this, this... Monster? Depraved monster. Depraved mm. monster. How? How did this happen? It's easy, Luce. It's all been pretty easy. Breaking up even Anne, fooling my father, and hey, did... Did you hear the one about the woman who ended up in Ian Thornhart's bed? Oh, sweetheart? What? That was her. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, I'm... Oh. I'm so sorry. How did that happen, do you think? Oh, and don't forget about Christina. Oh. What about, what about Christina? You want to know how easy it was to make that happen? All I had to do was say the words. What, what did you, what did you do? <laughs> Christina? Christina, if you did this, how did you do it? How? Easy. Love you, Mommy. Wasn't she great, folks? Let's give her a big hand. You did this. You transformed Livy into Christine, didn't you? You really are a man. Hey, 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 stand back. I'll take care of her, honey. You think you can, Livy? You want to try? You want to try me? Here, you want your little bow and arrow? Fine. I'll just have to take care of both of you, won't I? You can't even take care of yourself, can you, Lucy? It's like what an idea falling flat on its face. <laughs> he gets all. Hey. I'm gonna die. Karen, take it easy. You want me to take it easy? I'm a dead woman. You're not dead yet. <gasps> no, no, I get to decompose first at warp speed. I am falling apart inside right now, and it's all your fault. M my fault? You whipped up this vampire serum. You filled the hypo. Karen, that was an accident, and you know it. I, I wouldn't wish this on anyone. Well, you shouldn't have been playing God, okay? You're right. Sorry. Oh, look at that, does me. Karen, wait, look, I, I will... I will figure a way out of this, okay? I, I will... I'll find a way. How? I don't know how, but I'll get there. I created the serum. I can create an antidote. It's too late, Chris. No, it's not. Karen, look at me. Look, uh, I'll take care of this. As long as we're together, I will find a way. I'm sure there, there has to be a, a way out of all this. You just have to trust me. And as long as we work together, I will take care of you. and You'll be okay. Promise. I promise. Oh, God, Chris. It's okay. I got you. Just have to 
trust me. No, 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 don't. Don't let go, please. It's probably your pizza. It's open. Come on in. Just put it on the table. Karen? Frank. You know about Lucy? Aren't you going to ask me how I know about that? Doesn't matter how you know. Well, I'm just curious. Were you ever going to tell me that you slept with Lucy? I tried to tell you the other day. I wanted to tell you, but I, I couldn't. Know. I know. It just happened. Oh, yeah. That explains it. Two friends. Two true friends turned to each other for comfort. Because the two people that they cared about most in this world had betrayed them. You didn't give us any choice, Ian. Never lied to you. Before you slept with Lucy. So let me get this straight. You didn't lie about Anne Marie or any of the kidnappings. Or you didn't intentionally kill somebody else's husband. No. But you cheated on me with Lucy. You lied about that. So everything else I found out about you, that's all a lie? Never stopped loving you. And I'm sorry I hurt you. I didn't mean to do that. But what happened happened, and I can't change it. That's right. You can't undo what's already been done. And all that's left are lies. And that is so sad. Saddest thing of all is that you believe them. I can't trust you anymore, Ian. Don't you understand? I do. I understand that. And that's where all our trouble started. If you had some faith in me, we could have fought this. Oh, okay. So now it's my fault that you slept with Lucy. You're blaming me for this? You're not listening to me. Fine. Help me out here. What are you trying to say? I'm not trying to say anything. Just summing up. I'm sinking in. What is? I've gone too far. And we can't turn back. It's very clear. What? We don't belong together. Not anymore. Keep that away from me. Don't point it at me. Put it down. I've waited for this moment for a long time. Caleb, wait. She's still a slayer. She could have some tricks that we don't know about. Why don't you let me kill her for you? No. But I want to. Don't I deserve a reward after everything I've done? I want to kill her for you. You don't really mean that. Well, she does. No, you don't. Think about what you're doing, Livy. Think about what are you doing? Hoping my husband will give me the honor. How can I turn down such a tender request? She's all yours. Honey, her slayer energy is stronger when you're around. You know that. Why don't you enjoy the cool night air, and I'll catch up with you in a heartbeat. Enjoy yourself. Lucy, it's been an experience. Oh, God. Thank goodness he's gone. Doesn't hand that thing to me before you hurt yourself. You know, for a minute there, when he turned you into Christina, I thought maybe you were on Caleb's side, but obviously you're not, so give it. Don't move, Lucy! Oh, wait a minute, Livy. You can't be serious. Straight through the heart. It'll be faster that way. No, that's not in you, Livy. You wouldn't do that. You couldn't. Give it to it's me. It's over, Lucy. Don't do it. Please. Please think about what you're doing. Don't do it. What are you two doing here? I've been looking for you, Karen, ever since I found out you weren't in rehab or anywhere else. Well, okay, now you've seen her. Then Gabby saw the schedule and we found out Chris had signed out for a few days. Yeah, and that's when we put it together. I was trying to protect you, Frank. Protect me? From the truth. But now I, I guess I should have told you from the start. Told me what? When I got hooked again, Chris was there. 
You mean to supply you? To help me. I wouldn't have been here if it wasn't for him. I would have overdosed. But uh, he held in and he fought to save my life. And uh, we fell in love. You've got to be kidding me. I love him with all my heart. I don't believe you. I love him. Oh, no, no way. No, I, can't. I don't believe it either. I don't know what's really going on here, but there is no way you would give up Frank Gabby, for this. Gabby, excuse Frank, me? We both know it's not true. We both know no, that. No, 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 let me tell you something. He knows to believe what he sees with his own two eyes. Unless, of course, you need her to say it again. Death and I can't put him through that. Uh, at not. least, at, at least he won't hurt so much. He he can't he can't be angry with the woman he hates. The woman who betrayed him. Yeah, hey. Let it go, okay? Let it go. We have much more important things to concern ourselves with. Don't worry about him. It'll be okay. How? I don't get it. It doesn't make any sense. That's not her. That's not Karen. Frank. That, that person is nothing like her. It's, that, is, that isn't the Karen I know. The Karen I love. You don't think we belong together? <clears throat> Do you? What happens now? We stay as we are. Living together? Yeah, until we get down and back, and then we'll go from there. Fine, as long as you stay as far away from me as possible. It wasn't necessary. I'm just trying to lay the ground rules, OK? <clears throat> All right. Maybe it's best, because then I don't have to worry about you sneaking out with the needle. I did what I had to do to find out the truth. I told you the truth. I was always honest with you. Standing right here holding you wide open. I was holding you like I did so many other nights. And like so many other nights, you were just pretending. You know me better than that. No, I don't. I don't know you any more than you seem to know me. Caleb. Olivia, I was starting to worry. It's done then? She's dead. Are you sure? And now you can be too. Covid blood. I'd know it anywhere. <laughs> Only a slayer's blood has that certain sweetness. Lucy's dead. <sighs> Thank you, my love, for giving me the tastiest gift of all. Of all? Almost all. Oh, things couldn't be better. I have my fangs back. And with Lucy gone, all of her enemies have been destroyed. And now, it's just time for us to finish what we started. Together, my love. Lucy! Where are you? What happened? 
it. I can feel it. Oh, dear God. Maybe he actually did it. Stay tuned for scenes from the next Port Charles. Tempted. It's Port Charles. Caleb is back, and we have to put him away for good this time. Where's the Slayer? Can life possibly get any better? The Slayer woman's dead, and you, you've got your fangs back. There is one thing still missing. Up next, it's All My Children, followed by One Life to Live and General Hospital, right here on SoapNet.